Alex, what's going on? How are you? Keith Silverstein here, voice of Hawk Moth from Miraculous Tales of Hawk Moth, of course. Uh, pleasure to get to meet you like this, Alex. Now, um, Alex, you had a very interesting request for me. You wanted me to read in Hawk Moth's voice uh, a couple of paragraphs from Edgar Allan Poe's The Cask of Amontillado. So I will do my best at that for you. Uh, so much, so long as you don't use this for AI purposes. I know that's the new rage right now that I'm more than happy to honor your request. <clears throat> the thousand inquiries of Fortunato I had borne as best I could. But when he ventured upon insult, I vowed revenge. You, who so well know the nature of my soul, will not suppose, however, that I gave utterance to a threat. At length I would be avenged. This was a point definitively settled. But the very definitiveness with which it was resolved precluded the idea of risk. I must not only punish, but punish with immunity. A wrong is undressed when retribution overtakes its redresser. It is equally unredressed when the avenger fails to make himself felt as such to him who has done the wrong. It must be understood that neither by word nor deed had I given Fortunato cause to doubt my good will. I continued, as was my wont to smile in his face, and he did not perceive that my smile now was at the thought of his immolation. <laughs> Followed by, uh, of course, the evil laugh that is uh, necessary when uh, voicing Hawk Moth. Listen, Alex, so glad you've been a fan of the show. I hope you enjoy that. I hope you get a chance to see the film that's coming out next month. It's going to be unbelievably amazing, uh, if I do say so myself. Uh, wishing you all the best, Alex. <laughs> Nevermore.